Wish him all the best in his rehabilitation. On to the weather. Alexis is here. Is it going to stay gloomy and damp for the week? Not for all of us, no. Some of us are going to see some sunshine tomorrow. Oh. I'll give you that in the forecast. Uh, Kai Wilson took this picture of Buddy in the murky conditions at Delsum Country Park in Swanage. Penny Wade, well, I think she captured the mood, really, today at Barton-on-Sea. Becca Collicott found a little bit of colour on a grey day in Abingdon. So a very grey day. We saw some brighter spells and we'll hold on to the cloud cover overnight tonight. One or two clear spells here and there, but patchy drizzle is a possibility, especially during the second part of the night from this band of rain, which is working its way south and eastwards. So one or two clear spells. It's going to be quite a mild night. Temperatures tonight dropping to around 13 to 14 Celsius, which is around average for the daytime. Through the course of tomorrow, we'll see fairly cloudy conditions with some outbreaks of drizzle. Light rain and drizzle during the morning. That will clear southwards as will the cloud, but it will linger for southern coastal counties and the Isle of Wight. Elsewhere, areas north of Newbury will see more in the way of sunshine. A decent afternoon, in fact, there. The way we have the cloud, we could still have some patchy drizzle during the course of the day. Now that cloud will move its way northwards once again tomorrow night, introducing further low cloud over hilltop areas, perhaps some mist and fog patches and some patchy drizzle once again. Tomorrow, Tomorrow night's temperatures are not as high as tonight, but still fairly mild, lows of 11 to 14 Celsius. So patchy drizzle is a possibility through the course of Thursday. Thursday will be another cloudy day, limited brightness. One or two bright spells here and there, with the weather front sinking its way southwards, arriving from lunchtime onwards on Thursday. And this will bring more cloud and some outbreaks of patchy rain. But an area of high pressure is building in just in time for the weekend. And that means things will turn fresher, but we will have more in the way of sunshine. Here's the outlook for the next few days. Quite a lot of cloud up until Friday when we will start to see some sunny spells break through. The winds will be light until the weekend when we develop a northwesterly airflow. That air is coming in from the poles, so it will feel quite cold. A brisk northwesterly wind, the odd isolated shower, a lot of dry weather and more in the way of sunshine. So later on Friday, it will turn fresher with that northwesterly breeze with some brightness for the weekend. If you're out and about, despite the cloudy conditions, do send us your weather pictures to South weather at bbc.co.uk. Sally. Alexis, thank you very much. Uh, that's it from us this evening. More at 8 and then 10.30. Tomorrow, oh, a bit of golf. Yeah, incredible this. Two golfers who both got holes in one and the same round, a few holes wow. apart. Women or men? I think they were women golfers, actually. Yeah. Good stuff. I say no more. <laughs> that's it from us. Good night. <laughs> Good night. Yeah.